Dr. Jones, Dr. Jones, calling Dr. Jones. Welcome back, legal and gentle boys, to Life is Strange. We were in a storm, right? We were... Yes, we were. Oh, no. Memory of an elephant. Not again. Not again. Oh, getting Vietnam flashbacks now. Where are all the helicopters? You're tripping. Oh. Oh, look at the little deer. It's a bit loud. Look at the little deer. Let's go pet the deer. Let's go pet the deer. You remember in the, uh, in the first video when we saw the hurricane and then a ship? the hell yeah there was a ship that was torn into the tornado and flew into our faces more or less and uh, can you crawl underneath there or do, you have, do I have to go back for this one as well are you kidding me seriously I was just wondering if the hurricane is that strong that can tear a boat why can it not tear us apart Where did deer go? Lighthouse. Uh, la maison de lumière. As we say in French. I don't think that's how it's said in French. <laughs> ah! Quick. Park to the left. Yeah, because that's how logs roll. Are you my spirit animal? <gasps> You're my Patronus. Ah, oh, the cute little oh deer. The tornado is back. It's actually... A hurricane. Yeah, look at that. We saved ourselves this time. No, 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 no. Wait for me to walk by. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Could you walk faster, please? You're about to be squished by a lighthouse. Feel the pressure. Uh, yes, she is not here. But there is a newspaper. Check the date. 1969. Oh. Time to move! Oh, that's a hurricane, by the way, not a tornado. The tornado is headed straight for the town. Enjoy the view. Chloe, you're here. I'm back. Oh my lord, this is real, it's real. Oh man, this sucks. Max, what's going on? You totally blacked out. I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Oregon gets about five tornadoes every 20 years, which is so. No, no, I saw it. I could actually feel the electricity in the air. Come on, take a breath, okay? Chloe, I'm not crazy. But there's something else I have to tell you. Something hardcore. Talk to me, Max. I had the same vision earlier in class. When I came out of it, I discovered I could reverse time. Like I said, not crazy. But I, right? Listen to me. How do you think I saved you in the bathroom? By reversing time? Yeah, sure. I saw you get shot, Chloe. Saw you actually die. I was able to go back and hit the fire alarm. Okay, I see you're a geek now with a great imagination, but this isn't anime or a video game. People don't have those powers, Max. I don't know what I have, but I have it. And I'm scared shitless. You need to get high. It's been a hell insane fucking day. What the hell is this? Snowflakes? It's like 80 degrees. How? Climate change. Or a storm is coming. Max, start from the beginning. Tell me everything. How the hell is that climate change? I mean, you don't get me wrong, I I understand climate change, but that, I don't think that's how it works. Oh, douchebag! Is that electricity? Bite it. Bite the wire. Oh, this is her mother. The one who works in the diner. I think Chloe's mom. Forgot his name. Completely forgot his name. But we like him because he has a crush on Max. I don't know her story yet. I don't know why she's crying. This is a dog. That's a stoner. I prefer the dog. 
It's a bitch. A jealous bitch. This is a useless man. It was a bird on his desk. This is a bigger douchebag. Thinks he's bigger than he is. And the king of douchebags. What an introduction, Rachel. So many stories, so many people, so many things going on. I really want to know. Oh, that's already episode one. Okay, skip, skip. Blah, 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 blah. Nice, next, next, yes. Ticks, ticks and stuff. Exit. Episode two. Uh oh, oh, someone's gonna die again. It's every <gasps> Why is she always dying? What the hell is wrong with her? Just stay out of danger for five minutes. Continue. Oh my god. Skip. Skip. Don't care. We know what happened. We know what happened in the story, don't we? Could you please hurry up? Snooze every day. Snooze five times. I have like seven alarm clocks. Fourteen, because they all snooze at least once. Who else? I, I have a friend who only had one alarm clock. And he always got up. Like a machine. Those are scary people who can do that. Do you have one alarm clock? Then you're scary people. The time machine. I like the choice in music in this game. La vie est strange. Out of time. It's ironic because we can turn back time. We are literally never out of time. Go get a shower. You want to take your, take a selfie. No smiling. Take your power seriously. That's creepy. Don't do that. You're never, never gonna get insta fame if you take selfies like that. Tapped. Ooh, Chloe. You there, Mad Max? Always for you. No emoji. Meet at the diner in forty. I'll be there. Don't be late, I know time is not on your side. Don't get high like in my room, on my way. You are evil 40 minutes or else. Okay. Hey, mom. Blah, 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 principal. Blah, 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 you're a liar. Hey, honey, you'll be able to water the plant. Water the plant! Thank you, mom. Drink up. It's got electrolytes. You're giving it Gatorade or water? It's water. This action will have consequences. Why is the plan alive? Is it Groot? I looked at all those stuff. Look at the sticky notes. I can't keep my eyes open, but I know there's a scientific answer. Oh, she's trying to figure out how she can what turn back time. The law of thermodynamics can obviously be broken. Okay. Does she not know that she's in the game? Oh, so I need my clothes, right? Shower. It's well, to. Fun to get some peeps together and play a real game. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Guitar. Actually, let's play the guitar and see how good she is. Bedazzle me. Oh, she's just playing along with the music. Fine. Let's pick out some clothes and let's go take a shower. 
les vêtements. Or not. What is this? School schedule. I heard somebody say she has severe depression. Poor thing. Ooh. I better not leave without my shower supplies. Where the hell do you put your shower supplies? I cannot see your goddamn shower supplies. If I were shower supplies, where would I put myself? What it says shower supplies. Like large. Okay, In Max. Let's hit the showers now. Let's hit the showers now. Let's go. See who else is there. Don't forget I need those papers before tonight. Like now. Thanks, Sherry. Yeah, of course, Victoria. I'll get the tests and papers to you this afternoon. I'm so on it. Consider it done. Spineless. You are spineless, you coward. Ow. <laughs> hey, who did that? That wasn't me. How are you even looking at, man? Toilet paper. Oh, I need that. One quick rewind and I could stop this TP attack. God, you're such a social justice warrior. Oh my god. It's like, it's whatever. How do you want to stop it? Who even threw it? Ow. Like, what do you want me to do? You want me to dive in front of it? Like, warn her again? Warn her, quick. Ow. Ow, son of a whore. I swear to god. Go back far enough. Warn. Alyssa, can you stand over there? Um, okay, Max, if that makes you happy. Wow, now that was close. Thank you, Max. Are you not the slightest bit suspicious as to how I knew that was gonna happen? Alyssa? That action will have consequences. Is this a shower? Finally, I was looking all over. Come on, come on. College babes, college babes. Oh, 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 oh. oh it's just you. Hey, Kate. Oh, uh, hey, Kate. Sorry about yesterday. Yeah, I'm sorry you didn't do anything to help. <sighs> but you're just like everybody else here. Oh. It's not true. I wanted to help, but... But... Whatever. It's done. By the way, Max, do you still have my copy of The October Country? Oh, yes, of course. It's great so far. I didn't realize Bradbury was such a poet. Can you please bring it back to my room this morning? I just need to take some notes for class. Absolutely. I'll bring it by later. That girl is so not stable. I would take this shower. Oh, it's oh, someone's in there. What about this one? Oh, someone's in there. That's a shame. I don't want to say... That Kate was annoying just then, but she was a little bit annoying just then. Just like everyone else here, poor me. How was I supposed to help her in a previous video? She's gonna start crying now, is she? What's up, Kate? Oh, God. School. That's it. That video of you clubbing didn't look like homework. Victoria, that wasn't me. Oh my god, right. Don't be shy. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> you're going to be sorry someday. Oh, boo-hoo. I'm sorry you're a viral slut. I'm sure she had fun. Looks like it. I know Nathan hooked her up. And you know he has the good shit. Preach it, sister. Yup, I still have goddamn paint all over my face. Good thing my faithful minions took their sweet time bringing me a towel. We ran all the way- Give it a rest, Taylor. Now I know if I'm in an accident, I won't rely on you or Courtney for help. You can hang out with Kate. Or Max. Oh no, she didn't. Oh no. El Napa. She's a weirdo with that dumb camera. I hate that I'm so quirky crap. Anyway, let's leave the link to Kate's video so everybody gets a chance to see her in action. You are such an evil biatch. I love it. God, just so spineless. <laughs> Make your own opinion. Don't follow her. Weak people. 
Oh, you're such a biatch. <laughs> I totally want to follow you because I don't have my own personality. <laughs> oh my god, I want to slap them both so hard. What did you write here? Looks like you can barely spell anyway. What's this can I? Could, Water no. is almost as good as a cup of strong tea when I. Oh, I didn't mean to erase if it. If I can stop one person from watching it, it's worth it. It was just a link. Uh, use. Hello, water. Sorry, I forgot. Oh, just turn it back on and run away. How long do you shower? God, Rachel is a whore. This is a horrible school. I don't like it. Well, not the girls half so far. What was I supposed to be doing? Get getting dressed, I think. I don't know. Max, I wasn't really paying attention. I drift in and out with my attention span. Uh, what the hell? No fucking way. This is not why I came to Blackwell. And I still have to clean all this crap up after I find Kate's book. <sighs> I got I just, uh, Is this really what college is like? This feels more like high school, if anything. Paper search. No book here. Well, I will try the bookshelf. I can't even I can't even <laughs> I can't even check out the bookshelf. It's the most obvious place. Here maybe? Oh, great. She just spilled soda on Kate's book. I better fix this fast. Kate needs the book, and I don't want to add to her list of problems. Why did you even have soda in the morning? Would you not go back so fast? Be gone, foul soft drink. Now take. Aha, you sneaky book. You're mine. Sneaky book. Let's get dressed. I miss Chloe. The only Maybe sensible. Put on a shirt and jeans. Hey, Einstein had the same exact suit for every day of the week, and he couldn't even rewind time. Nobody did understand time better than you do. Now so we'll finally take this back to Kate before I'm late. As take if it to I Kate. have to worry about being late anymore. <laughs> I do have all the time in the world now. Yes, you do. I would be out stealing stuff. I would not use my powers for good. I mean, probably yes, occasionally, but generally speaking, no. Keep your smart mouth shut about everything, or I'm coming for you, as I know where you sleep. It's it's Nathan, oh, isn't it? Shit. Now I'm getting anonymous threats. It never ends. This has to be from Nathan. Yeah. But it could be anybody. I better be doubly careful around here, or I could be in serious danger. Ah, don't worry about it. I'm not already. Okay. You in there? Yes, I'm here. I'm in there. I feel sorry for her. I really do. Not because she has a smelly rabbit. But for some reason she's very sad and depressed. Probably should ask for permission next time before taking pictures of other people's animals. So hey. Hey, Kate, I brought your book. Max, why didn't you do anything when David harassed me yesterday? I wanted proof David was in your face. I thought he was different. I'm happy to see that somebody cares. Kate, I actually do care. So, what's the story with you and David? Well, he's a total paranoid ass. He thinks I'm part of the Vortex Club. Yeah, right. Why does he think that? Because he saw the video. You know how humiliating this is for me? I know this sucks, Kate, but... Tell me about the video and maybe I can help. Basically, I went to one Vortex Club party and ended up making out with a bunch of people. And I have no memory of it. So, why would you go? Lapse of sanity? I just thought I could meet some new people. You have to tell me more than that. What happened at the party? Did you drink? I swear to God, I had one sip of red wine, and then I drank water. Not enough to get wasted, is it? I don't get wasted. 
ever. I take a sip at church and I don't end up on a viral video, okay? Did somebody drug you? I remember... I remember getting sick and dizzy. Go on. Then Nathan Prescott said he would take me to the hospital. Nathan Prescott? Oh shit. He was being nice for a change when he offered to help me. He's the opposite of nice. What next? All I recall is driving for a long time. Then I woke up in a room. I thought it was a hospital because it was so white and bright. Go on. I'm listening. Somebody was talking to me in a soft voice. I thought it was a doctor until I heard Nathan and felt a sharp sting in my neck. And... And... And? That's all I remember. I don't know what happened. I woke up outside my dorm room the next day. Ooh. I didn't have any marks or bruises, but I felt gross. Ooh. So, who took the video of you at the party? I have no idea. Probably Victoria. She was there being her mean self. Jesus, Kate. I'm sorry. This is serious shit. How do I get a viral video taken down? I know it's already spreading. What if my church sees that? I need to know what to do. Kate, we'll figure it out. I'll check back later, okay? Thanks, Max. You can put my book here near my bag. What the shit? I thought it was gonna be... So, Max, can I ask you a question? And please be honest. Absolutely, Kate. Anything. I need to find out if Nathan Prescott helped me or hurt me after that party. Should I go to the police? <sighs> well, I'll look for proof is actually a good point. <sighs> you gotta look for proof. Going to the police isn't gonna do anything if you don't have proof. If you do that, they won't believe you. Mm -hmm. You're on video grabbing at all those guys and they'll use that against you. Mm -hmm. Bad. But I know I was drugged. That's what you have to prove, not them. I'm just telling you how the cops in school will look at this. The video doesn't exactly back you up. You make me feel so hopeless. No, no, Kate. I just don't want you to get hurt anymore. That seems impossible at this point. So that's your answer? I, I think we should wait. There are other things going on that might help you. But not right now. So I can walk down the halls with people calling me a viral slut. Thanks, Max. Oh my god. She's, I swear to god, I feel sorry for you, but you're so goddamn annoying. Just being so emotional Good at the job, moment. Dr. Max. No! She didn't like what I had to say, but we need more proof of what happened. Yeah, I'm not gonna go back for that one. I swear to god, this woman, so emotional, cannot just think objectively for three seconds. <sighs> Bible. Let's look at the Bible. That's always a good laugh. Kate even makes notes in her Bible. My parents never once took me to church. I had nothing to rebel against. I don't know what to believe now. Kate's room is usually immaculate. For her, this must be a pigsty. Well, she's going through some stuff right now, so... I don't, I don't look at every damn thing. Okay, look at the tablet. Kate is all alone dealing with this video bullshit. Ooh. I hope her mother doesn't disown her. Ooh. We'll pray for you and expect you to pray for forgiveness. Right, because that's going to solve all your problems. Ouch. She left out amnation. Nice me the devil going to prepare me for what you've done in the videotape. Oh my god, Auntie Marsh already sent her a mail. Oh my god, everyone... Everyone's disowning her, the whole church. Good lord. This must be Kate's H.R. Geiger period. Who tells H.R. Geiger? Okay, I get it. She's going through some stuff. That's a lot of tears. She's going to go through boxes. Yeah, she is. I get it. Okay. Not much we can do about it, okay? We have to find proof. Mm, thanks a lot, Max. What the hell do you want me to do? Do I look like NCIS? Chloe, Max, food, two whales, see you there, don't hurt your fingers texting, yay breakfast, no emoji, 
What's wrong with emojis? I like emojis. It, oh, going to say hi to this chick. Hey, Dana. What's happening, Dana? Everything cool between you and Juliet? Oh, yeah. Thanks again for releasing me from her captivity. By the way, the best and biggest news of the day is that Trevor asked me to the Halloween shindig. <gasps> That's awesome, Dana. At least we're showing our faces together in public. So you absolutely should go with us. Borrow one of my outfits and come as a cute geek couple with your bitch Warren. Uh, I'm not big on cosplay. Don't let life pass you by, Max. So, are you coming to the party or not? No, because everyone who's going to a party so far has been having some bad experiences. No, sorry. It's just not my thing. You came to Blackwell to discover yourself, not hide in your dorm. I won't discover myself avoiding projectile vomit from bro dudes. Thanks anyway. Yep, contraceptive pills. So, you having sex, huh? Hmm, <laughs> is that it? Really? Oh, hey, I didn't see you there. How are you doing? Hello, Juliet. Hey, Max. Did you check out Kate's hot video yet? That's so not cool. I didn't get wasted on camera and get busy with the Vortex Club. Kate's not like that, and you know it. Really? Check her out and tell me what she's like. Do you believe everything you see? Like Zachary sexting Dana? Burn! Now I feel like an ass. Thanks for finding out the truth yesterday. What did you do about Victoria pulling that crap? Nothing yet. My mind works in devious ways, too. Glad to see you're back in action. You have a good heart, Max. And I won't watch Kate's video anymore. Or pass it on. That's the spirit. Thanks, Juliet. Sure. Aww. Talk to you later. That's nice. Okay, time to get some food. Brooke, how you doing? Who the hell are hi, you? Brooke. Oh, hi, Max. What's up? Did you see the freak snowfall yesterday? I was riveted by that weird snow flurry yesterday. I can't tell if you're being serious or not. Um, since I'm a science noob, I was wondering if you could explain it. I'm serious. Even meteorologists can't explain that snow. I bet Warren can. Did you talk to him yet? I will later. Lucky you. I'm sure he'll track you down, Max. I'll see you around. See, this is a normal person. That's a nice conversation. She was not a bitch. She was nice and kind and talkative. You know, that's what that's what conversation should be like. But talking to everyone else so far in this game has been so stressful. <coughs> so stressful. I just don't want to talk to people. Not even this guy. Bird! Look at the bird. The birds are flocking around Samuel. Hey, Birdman. Hey, Samuel. You're up early. Oh, Hello, young Max. I do love the early morning. Everything is so calm and quiet. And I can feel the animals waking up with me. That's one thing I truly love about Arcadia Bay. It's all those cool animals in the forest. The squirrels always come in the morning for food. I can hear them whisper. What animals do you see in the forest? Don't laugh, but I saw a doe that seemed to be looking right at me, like it was trying to communicate. Oh, that's your spirit animal. Nothing weird there except you saw yours. Could be a sign about your destiny. <laughs> what do I know? My spirit animal is a squirrel. So, what did you think about that freak snow shower yesterday? Another message from the Earth to get our shit together. I will say that Samuel hasn't seen anything like that before. I so don't want to get in the way of your morning ritual. See you later. Of course you will. Well, this guy's creepy as hell. Refers to himself in a third person. Samuel's spirit animal is a squirrel. So, hey, warrior, what is up? This is Nathan's father. Oh my god. Then you know that attempts to slander and blackmail my son will be met with many laws and legal ramifications. You're not the first student, blah blah blah. Hope you consider this a fine, polite warning. Suck my left Dad, Asian testicle. I'm right here. Warren, what are you doing here? Oh, nothing. Waiting for a call? I mean, I already took the call. Anyway, I wanted to rap about that action yesterday. By the way, thank you for stepping in. You were pretty badass, Warren. I owe you. 
Oh, yes, you do. I got knocked on my ass by that dick. I'm some personal superhero. You're a real everyday hero. You stood up to a bully, and it was awesome. Even though you left me with said bully and ran off with that girl, she's pretty punk rock. How do you know her? <laughs> An old friend, Chloe Price. We haven't seen each other in a while. I bet you were glad to see her blast up in that truck like a rock star. Which begs the question, why is Nathan Prescott getting psycho on you? Because he's a drug addict. I busted him in the bathroom yesterday with a gun. I'll give you the story later. Principal Wells is taking care of it now, I hope. You're fucking weak. Like that bizarro snowfall yesterday? Speaking of dystopia, that drive-in is having a 70s Planet of the Apes marathon. Let's go ape! Sure. Yes, that's exactly what I mean. I love those old school ape films. Well, that was easier than I thought. Cool, I'll text you the info. See, that's nice. Now watching movies and stuff together. That's what my college is mostly about. Hanging with friends. I don't drink alcohol, so I don't really go to parties that often. If I do, I'm usually the guy who sits in the corner Even awkwardly. To Nathan cannot be a good thing. This has something to do with Kate or Rachel. Sure. Morning. Sit in the back with the cool kids. Or in the middle, whatever. Your life. Ah, music. Drown out the world. I like how they use music in the game, but it's a lot of music in the game. Like every other scene has a song. I think they really intended to make this game more of a movie than a game. Judging by all the dramatic emotional music scenes. Don't try to take it from me. It's mine. I wouldn't dream of it. Be a millionaire. Hope nobody steals my lottery. Talk about going back in time. The diner looks exactly the I bet he's seen a lot of changes to Arcadia Bay. No time for chit chat. I'm a millionaire. Yep. Got my lottery ticket right here. Waiting for the bus so I can cash it in. Alright. Alright, sir, you have a good morning. I'm gonna have my whales now. Man, Don't they? The smell of breakfast and the sound of Good lord. Talk about apocalyptic. It's a house. Where is she? Donde es? Why can't I talk to everyone? Why would I want to talk to everyone? Donde esta? Running late, grab booth for the dinner, mom will feed you, somebody better. Uh, I'll be lucky if you make it by noon. <laughs> I will grab the booth in the corner. Oh, food, nice. Drool, want everything. Donut, gotta get the donut. Do I talk to mom first or do I get the booth first? I don't want to talk to Tucker. Trucker. Booth, sit. Hi, mom. And there she is. Lovely young woman. <laughs> How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. It's nice to see you again. You look the same. <laughs> like I'm still a waitress at two whales after all these years. No, like you still look pretty. Nice save, kid. You're still smart. But not that smart. Now you get busted for smoking pot. <sighs> <laughs> I heard the whole sordid story from David. I'm sorry this was how you had to meet him. He's a good man. No matter what Chloe says. Yeah, I'm sure. I don't even smoke, like, ever. It was almost an accident. It was very stupid. I'm, I'm sorry. Oh, it surprised me fierce. 
I was hoping you could be a good influence in her life now. I will be. Promise. I know things were hard for you and Chloe. I feel bad I didn't call. Now my folks are in Seattle and I'm all alone at Blackwell. It's my karma. You did the right thing. You moved forward with your life. I did after William passed on. Chloe? Chloe chose to stay angry. Anyway, I hope we see more of you. Chloe needs an old friend again. Joyce, I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. I'm glad, Max. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Even if Chloe doesn't understand yet. <laughs> Chloe understands. She just needs time. I know that sucks for you. Oh, she hit all the phases. Expulsion, running away, drugs, bad boys, tattoos, piercings, blue hair. <laughs> Now she's got to rebel against her stepfather. I see why, I mean. Do you? He's not as much of a hard ass as you think. But you did tell him you had a joint, right? You took that responsibility? I did. And I am sorry. I don't want Chloe in any more trouble. Or me. Nobody's in trouble over a doobie, Max. And I admire that you took the heat for Chloe like a great friend but Chloe does push David and it's not fair he paid his dues in a war he does care about her along with all the students at Blackwell oh. I get it Joyce I know Chloe still likes to stir things up yeah she does provoke people especially David I just want us to be a family soon I guess it's all about time I think you're right Joyce so now let's get down to the nitty gritty. What do you want to eat? Double bacon cheeseburger, Belgian waffle, or bacon omelet? Waffle. The last good Belgian waffle I had was here when I was 13 years old. So, bring it on. Now finish your coffee. Tell me what to do. I will drink it, but only because I choose to. Bitch. Graffiti! One Nerd graffiti. Warren must have been here. I love it. The only thing that's changed on the menu are the prices. Hash browns. Oh my god, I got hash browns. It's really good. I love hash browns. Hash browns and orange juice. Oh, so good. Drink. This is like fourth dimensional deja vu. I keep going back in time. Can I get some beer and bacon before I die? This is a diner, not a bar. No beer? <laughs> Looks like you had plenty. Stick with the bacon. Do I keep drinking or do I look out the window now? The lighthouse looks so mysterious. I wish I could stay in this moment forever. I guess I actually can now. But then it wouldn't be a moment. What kind of dive is this? Drink again then. Oh, skip it. You'll love this. I'm drooling like a baby. Still can't believe you're a woman. When I look at pictures of Chloe, ah. Oh. Mm, speak of the devil. Hey, devil. Mom and Max together again. And Chloe looking for a free meal. Put your whole damn college fund on your tab. I'm treating Chloe for breakfast. Are you atoning for yesterday? Oh god, Mom, please do not give Max any shit for that. She apologized. I know she did. Max is a good girl. A woman. She's 18 now. Too old to get lectures from you or Sergeant Pepper. Call him David if you don't want to be lectured. You only get one damn slice of bacon a day. Ooh. What a punishment. Still the same. Another reason to blow this town. What is this shit on the jukebox? Put some ABBA on there. Now that that's out of the way. Let's talk about your superpower. I don't have any explanation. And I can't explain why I saw that crazy fucking tornado. 
Come on, that's such a daydream. I want proof you can rewind time. This is all happening so fast. We'll start slow. Right here, now. Mm, I can tell you every single thing you have in your pockets. You have x-ray vision, dude? I don't even know what's in my pockets. Let me see. Okay, Max. Impress me. Well, I have to, so I have to guess every time and then go back. Two of glitter. You have a tube of glitter in there, right? Nada. Eh, wrong answer. Okay, go back. Psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. Coins, key, smoke, post it. Coins, key, smoke, post it. I got it. Let's go back. Quickly, 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 faster, 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 faster. Oh. There we go. Well, this is me telling you what's inside your pockets. Okay, Max. I'm hella ready. Okay, so yeah, keys. Your car keys. Duh, way too easy. I need details. Describe my keychain. It's a red black bear. Or a skull. It looks like a bear. A skull keychain for a punk <laughs> like you. That was so wrong. Max. Damn. <laughs> okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's happening. Skip. Oh. I, okay, I'll look at it, memorize it a okay, bit better. Max. It's so bear. Every item carefully and don't forget anything. Bear key one two three four five six seven smokes of cigarettes. Uh, a couple of coins. I'm not gonna count that. And a warning ticket. Good. I better not have had to count the coins. I'm not used to counting foreign coins. A hurry up! Oh my god. Cigarettes, that's the easy one. I'm pretty sure you have cigarettes on you. Yes, you know I'm a smoker. But how many cigarettes? Ah! I have... Damn, I think it was seven. Seven cigarettes. A superpower that allows you to count cigarettes. Cool. Amazing. Something else in my pockets? Uh, you got to, oh, she wants to know how much money, damn it. Your car keys. Duh, way too easy. So what the hell did I get wrong last time? So, oh, it's panda. A cute robot panda keychain. Not bad, Super Max. You do have that Irish luck call build. What else? A parking ticket. You know me well. But what is the exact time I was busted? I don't know. I have no freaking idea. That's too early for you. That's probably too early for you. That that makes more sense. 11, 10 a.m. That is so. Oh. Cool. Okay, psychic girl. Now you got a parking ticket. Up. You know me. 10:34. 10:34 a.m. Booyah! Max can tell time. Even a broken clock is right twice a day. Whatever the hell that means. <laughs> That's more than enough evidence. Some money. Clearly, I'm rich as fuck. How much do I have? 86. Cents. 86 cents. That's right, living large in Arcadia Bay. <sighs> I thought you didn't know what you had in your pockets. Amazeballs. I literally just got chills all over my neck. You Amazeballs. have powers. I'll take that crap off the table, Chloe. Sure, Mom. How's the food, Max? Better than I remembered. Very good save. <laughs> and I'm hungry like the wolf. Clearly. I'm freaking out about what just happened. You, you have to show me more. Something way cooler so I will believe you without any doubt. I will predict the future. No way. Okay. Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments. So you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. Mama's gonna wave. Oops. Did you break another cup? Really? No refill for you. No refill for you. Well, now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're Police. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. Is that enough? Because my memory's not gonna last that long. Can I go back now? Predict the next 30 seconds. Seriously, I have to do this three times. Trucker dropped his mug. So, 
and then the partner leaves the gets an emergency alert on his radio well let's and then there's a fight and joy stops them just an this is getting good and then something about a fly landing on it or something or cockroach crawls on it there you go it's that one the jukebox goes crazy as a cockroach crawls on it sure Pretty bizarro max but let's see if everything happens like you said Did you break another cup? Oh, wait, really? Go, Mom. No refill for you. Shh. Now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You called it. But he's off to go bust some skaters. You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. Trevor and Justin must be in love. You predicted a cockroach on the jukebox? I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. This isn't a toy, Chloe. I do have to be careful how I use it. Scoop that? Of course it's a toy. The best toy ever? You can bang anyone with no strings attached, rewind time, and boom! It's like it never happened. Grow up. Maybe um. you made a move on me and I would never know. Yes, that's what I did. You can rewind time, Max. That's fucking insane. We have to play. I don't have time. You did not just say that. <laughs> uh, check out your <gasps> nose. Too much blow? Hey, are you okay? Too much excitement. See what happens when we hook up again? Then, let's go to one of my secret lairs and fully test your power. You need a sidekick to guide you. Okay, girl wonder. Show me the way to Chloe's gate. I hope there's nothing wrong with Max. Like the superpowers causing her nose bleed and stuff. Bye, trucker. Bye, Chloe's mom. Oh, I'm kind of worried now. Oh, do I also do I have to speak to you? Do I have to pay? Okay, Supergirl. Let's go to my secret place. Don't even answer. We have places to go and what we do. Come on, before mom starts some more shit, let's bail. It's Kate Marsh from Blackwell. Big whoop. You don't call me once in five years and now you're all over some biatch you see every day at school? I see how you roll. So go ahead. Chat up Kate Marsh from Blackwell. I've got other people to hang out with too. Oh, but she's such a child. I'm gonna answer that. Hey, Kate. What's up? Please don't let your best friend get in the way. You oh okay? My God. I promise, Kate. I won't forget. I swear. Just do your homework and don't stress. I really don't think we should go into this right now. I'll call you later, okay? Thanks, Max. If you'd rather chill with Kate. Please, go ahead. You are ridiculous. I'm chilling with you, okay? For now, let's rock. You can never win in this game. You're always gonna offend someone. Welcome to the 21st century. Sucks that Chloe and Joyce got into an argument. <sighs> you can never win in this game. Oh god, is this another pedo? We will find that out on the next video, ladies girls and gentle boys. Hope you're enjoying this game. The story progresses really slowly because you have to check out so many stuff. Lots of dialogues you have to have with everyone. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this part. Hope you're enjoying the game. Let me know what you think about it. Hope to see you on the next video. You guys take care now and have a very bad day.